Hi, brothers and sisters. It's Pastor Tim Henderson. I have with me the loveliest bride in all the land. Say hi, Karen. Hello. And my boy Jaden. Say hi. hi. Say God bless you. God bless you. Say Jesus is Lord. Jesus. He's coming soon. He's coming back. Amen. Amen. So I wanted to bring you up to speed on some stuff going on with the wall and the immigration. Listen, we know things are going crazy in the world right now. You have Russia and Iran, which I've already reported, warships and nuclear bombers in Venezuela, in the Western Hemisphere, ready to uh, defend and support that socialist nation. Um, now, today, in open meetings with Democratic leaders Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi, our president, he's even tweeted, he was actually very strong in what he was saying. If he does not get the support of Congress to build the wall to protect our nation and our borders, which I agree with him on that, he is ready and prepared. He threatened to shut the government down and further stated that the military would then build the wall. He's going to have that wall. And, and so, of course, you, got, you have the progressive left saying that's wrong, that approach is wrong. Of course they are. Listen, we are in a time of, I talk about the dominoes, that want, any second, anything could happen to blow the whole thing open. And just know that this is all part of, listen, I've said this before, and you've got to hear this. It, no man, no woman, no leader, no nation, no, no league of nations is going to stop what God has declared in his word would come to pass. And things are lining up. As believers, as the body of Christ, we should be encouraged. While these are sobering times, these are very exciting times. We are living in the most exciting time in church history. Now keep your eye on what's going on. Could we see a government shutdown before the end of the year? We could. Are things still tense in France and other European nations? Boy, are they. Are things tense in Syria and the Middle East? You bet. Now you've got Russia and Iran and Venezuela. You've got natural disasters happening. Earthquakes. It seems like every day we're reporting earthquakes in seven something magnitudes. I mean, can we, do we need any more signs? Do we need any more? Well, should the Lord tarry and we be here Sunday, the Lord has given me a message for Sunday. I will keep reporting on things that are going on that I believe are, are we're seeing the puzzle pieces put together. But know this, at any moment, <laughs> with a shout, with the voice of the archangel and the trumpet of God, our Lord could descend to the clouds and we will be caught up together to meet him in the air, the bride. And I am so excited about that. So I want to encourage you. I love you. I'm praying for you. Stay tuned for these updates. I just want to keep everyone informed. There's just so much that's happening within a day. Listen, we occupy and redeem the time. God bless you. May his shalom, his peace that passes all understanding be yours. And, and I pray Holy Spirit leads you and you hearken and listen to those divine appointments, those moments where you can have an everlasting impact. Until I come on again or we meet in the air, I, I pray blessing on you all. Love you.